Hi, this is Alka, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I want to let you know before I start the video that I have other sites I'm putting videos on because there's some stuff that's a little too spicy for uh, YouTube, especially now that I'm going after Twitter. Uh, so, um, so that way Twitter can't take the videos down. They'll be on this other site, Rumble especially. So if you haven't followed follow anyone on Rumble yet, maybe it's time for you to do so. Anyway, on to the video. Um, despite the fact that Twitter said that my suspension was due to abusive behavior and violent content tweet, the people that I tweeted about are still doing the abusive behavior and violent uh, actions on the subway. Last night, a woman was slashed at the 59th Street train station after an argument and sent to the hospital. This is another incident that is occurring on the transit system, which by now even Eric Adams admit he doesn't feel safe on it. The situation has gotten worse because of the pandemic, because of low ridership, uh, the homeless, the mentally ill and the fair beaters are have taken control of the system and then doing what they please. No, they're not paying for the services rendered, but they're causing unsanitary conditions and they're threatening people. Trans employees are being constantly attacked on a daily basis and so are the passengers. And this is again proof that the Violence is not occurring from my tweet, it's occurring within the system itself. So, the thing, best thing you can do is to protect yourself at all times. Don't argue with any of these idiots in, in the system. And they want us to argument, call 911 on these jokers. Get away as fast as you can because these people are dangerous. They are out to harm you any which way they can because they know that the man district attorney ain't gonna do jack shit towards him. Unless it's a second degree murder charge. So, be careful on the subways and the buses, because even they are having uh, crime problems too. So, this is our can't say so long for now, and don't forget to stop and be safe. These politicians gotta do more to clean up the clean up the system.